hello everyone uh, in this video we will just teach you how to format a cell based on other cell value for example you would like to format the whole record okay the whole row or you would like to um, just format this cell based on another value okay like this or this or this value okay to format a cell based on other cell value also we can format a record or just single uh, cell okay so let's do it okay let's, let's start it first of all i will show you the absolute and relative path okay for example i will write an example equal to for example if this was equal to with fail yeah it was equal to with fail so it just showed us true if i drag it down what will happen see be how false false true false because these two are not equal to with fail because if we look at the formula here the formula is i5 equal to 5 uh, fail if we come here now i6 okay the column the row has changed okay the row has changed uh, as we are coming down so it will change the row also okay if we come here so it will select this row if we come here it will select this one this one and with this one so this is the relative path okay that we we have right now okay this one also if we drag it uh, to the right side false because it will select now it will check with this cell okay let's check it see j5 j5 this it will check this with fail so this is relative path if we are moving to the right side or down it will go according to that so let's make it uh, uh, absolute path okay what will happen so to make it absolute for example so we can add here to the formula okay to the formula we can add dollar sign dollar sign to the column dollar sign to the row number now we lacked both row and column okay it will just check this cell with all other uh, if we go to the right side or down okay so let's press enter what happened see right now we have uh, true because that is uh, true okay if fail is equal to with that cell if we come down true 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 Be what why because if we come here to the formula to this cell c again i5 if we come here i5 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 okay because it this cell we lacked it this is absolute path we lacked um, here okay we lacked that if we go to the right side or to the left side it will just check that cell with fail uh, with fail okay so this is absolute but if we want to f uh, lack just the column okay for example just come here we want just to lock the column not the row press this one and press enter okay that is equal to now let's drag it down what happened again we have the true value the exact okay this is not equal false false true false why because right now the column is lock with us it will check the same column i i i i but the row will change okay but if we go to the right side what it will do again the same column but it will change the row like uh, just come here here we have i5 equal to with fail here we have i5 i5 because it is the same row the row is the row is the same here 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 this is the same row but the column the column was locked so this is the absolute and uh, relative path now let's apply it okay for example we want to um, just format this uh, uh, name column okay uh, later from this we will just um, format the whole record the whole row so whenever we select this so now uh, we will come here okay mm, come here to the conditional formatting come here to the new rule okay new rule come here to the use a formula to determine which cells to format okay select this one now here we will write our formula so to write our formula we will write equal to i5 okay i5 was equal to with fail the right now so now what we will do the column is the same column with us this is the same column but the row will change so we will lock the column okay so let's change lock the column dollar sign before that if it was equal to with fail we will format that name okay to read color okay okay so just these two name has changed okay the value of those two name has changed see these are filled with us so the name the format of that has changed to read color so now let's uh, clear it uh, i will just clear conditional formatting clear from entire sheet now i would like to um, 
select the whole uh, row okay if a student was fast so we will select the whole we will format the whole row so for that select the whole records after selecting it come here to the conditional formatting new rule this one again again this equal to lock the column i5 was equal to with fast if it was equal to with fast for the past what we will do we will change the background color to this green color okay okay see we have three student fast and the whole row has selected like this formatted like this we can format is how much you can bold the text italic uh, increase the size whatever you want so you can do that so it was all about this okay to just format a cell based on other cell value I hope this video was helpful for you. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.